Oh, this is a huge number. The distance from sun to earth is this much. I don't know how to read such a big number. Our teacher taught us about the place value of a number. Can't we use place value to read this number? Yes, we can use it. But teacher told us about separating this number into periods. Do you remember it? I think we can ask it from our teacher. Teacher, can you please tell us how to read this number and how to separate this number into periods? That's very easy to separate this number into periods. You have to start from the right side of the number and separate after each three digit like this. In American method, a comma is placed to separate the periods. But in standard method, the periods are separated by leaving a small gap in between periods without a comma. Teacher, how to name these periods? I will show you it in a table. From the right side, first period is units, then thousands, then millions. After that, billions are there. But here, there are no digits in billions. In each period, there should be three digits. But in the most left period, there may be one or two digits. Let's try to read this number. You know how to read a number with three digits. Then tell me, what is the three digit number in millions? It is 147. What is the three digit number in thousands period? It's 390. Yes. The number in the units period is 0. So, we can read this number as 147,390,000. After the three digits number, you have to read the name of the period. But in the units period, we don't mention it. Look at this number. The standard form of this number is this. We can read this number as 54,329,170. Another number. First, we'll separate it into periods. I'll represent it in a table. There is another new period, which is billions. Let's read it. 6,538,000,000. 708. I will read again. 6 billion, 538 million, 751,208. In this way, you can read any number. But if the number is in standard form, then it is very easy to read. Okay, teacher. Thank you. Now we can read any number. Goodbye, teacher.